Okay, now we're taping. We're live. Uh, this is the travel experience with Brian B. Circa 2009. We're looking at February 25th as the date. It's been an interesting uh, couple weeks, but uh, getting to the tail end of this trip, I think there's a good chance this could end today. Actually, this week, but <clears throat> here's the scoop. We're in New York City. I'm here to pick up gear. Problem is, license expired on my birthday, which was two days ago. The issue being that when I went in to go get the license renewed, basically, they told me I had a ticket from Alaska. I've only been to Alaska one time in my life, year 2000. Problem being that they don't take credit cards over the phone in Alaska, apparently. You have to fax in some sheet. It takes about 48 hours. So, good buddy Hunter Dawson, right in front of me, came out, roommate, to help me drive. I was going to pay for the rental. They don't take credit cards, or, I'm sorry, debit cards, only credit cards. Oh, hey, look at this. So, anyway, we're just kind of hanging out in New York City, you know, and um, it's just funny, though, because nobody takes credit cards, or no one takes uh, uh, debit, uh, debit, debit or check cards. Um, no one wants our money. And so we're just kind of wandering around New York City, trying to find someone to drive us back to Florida. So Pretty we're much here it. with a truckload of gear and no truck. So we're just working on the truck part. And me and, me and this chick are going to hang out here for a little bit. We have been searching the streets, waiting to hear back from the truck company that is going to let us rent it. Because we're going to get not a quality SUV, but no, an upgrade to a U-Haul mini truck. Nothing like that to drive back to Florida with, you know, luxury at its finest. Well, but anyway, turn you back over to the streets of New York and kind of see that we have a paramedic situation going on. What the heck? You can see it. An ambulance. I don't even know what's going on. The world is coming to an end and I don't have a way to get back to Florida. I'm just trying to get my gear back. Jeez. Question to ponder for the day is this. What is up with the people on hold? I mean, the whole holding situation. When you put somebody on hold, what is proper etiquette? Is it a minute, two minutes, five minutes, or 20? I think the longest today I've been on hold has been 35 minutes. A little long, wouldn't you say? I don't know. 35 minutes. 35 minutes. HD saying 35 minutes. Okay, so let me um, fill you in on some of the latest stuff. Uh, first of all, have you ever seen a Hungarian meat market? You never know what kind of food might be just awaiting your palate to be able to taste. And then we got the Abbey Locksmith. That's where I'm headed right now because I've lost my key. In addition to everything else, I've lost my key to my storage unit to get in. So I've got to buy some bolt cutters just to freaking open my storage unit. Well, denied access there. They don't uh, sell bolt cutters, allegedly, to the peons, the common folk. It's got to be sent to, uh, sold to a licensed locksmith, apparently. So I'm headed back to Starbucks where good old Hunter's eating a scone. I'm charging my phone. About to go to the U-Haul pickup place because U-Haul, like I said, does accept debit cards. Amazing concept, isn't it? All right, we're in New York City. Going to dinner, got everything. Uh, we'll actually probably start this road trip actually at about 8 o'clock, 8.30, something like that, once we finally get out of here. We're about to go grub. Get our grub on. We're rolling up in the nicest restaurant in New York City in a gigantic freaking U-Haul. <laughs> yeah, that's that's always the thing. What it, I like about it, though, is as I put my blinker on, I go, and I just start coming over and everybody stops. Yeah, yeah. So, I, I think the cool thing about it is it keeps it real. I mean, we're not trying to be this something that we're not. We're trying to be, just keep it like southern, keep it. We're not fronting. No, not at all. Not no, at all. No, no playing here. No. We're we're like we're rolling up, and we got room for a bunch of Mexicans. And so, if anybody wants to go, we're yeah. letting them know. Hey, we're calling you all right now. If you want to come out to Florida, feel free. This is the time to get on board because uh, we're ready for you. So DC, we'll meet you there. Next stop, food. Some other things Food. that are kind of cool here. Waldorf Astoria is right there. You don't see that every day. That's a pimp. 
Ah, dude, that's cool. We would stay there, but we want to keep it real. Keeping it real. Where's, um, City Banks? City Banks? I don't think they want to see me. I drove by and I saw my picture posted on their wall. <laughs> Brian asked me earlier, he goes, don't you have, like, an account with them? I'm like, well, define have an account. I'm like, every time they call me, they want money, so our relationship doesn't work really good. So he's like, oh, hey, you didn't pay your bill, or hey, we need more money from you. It's not like, hey, how's it going? How's life? You know, is everything going good? Can we send you a cup of coffee or something? No, it's like, hey, you didn't pay your bill for the fifth month in a row. Whatever. What do they know? They don't know much. They, they don't just know don't much. care about the people. No, they don't. The little just, people. It's 